I feel very privileged to work in BNB where the first robot is installed in Nepal. I think it's, it is a need of the time because uh, most of the countries in the world, they are, they are already doing robotic surgery, robotic urological surgeries for the last more than decades. So I think we are also heading towards the same direction and it is very essential. It is need of the time. I think. There are certain advantages of robotic surgery, especially in urological surgeries that we do. Uh, few of the urological surgeries that are very challenging in terms of locations, in terms of durations and in terms of uh, surgical procedure itself. So there are proven and distinct benefit of robotic surgeries and I'm sure it is going to change the way we provide uh, our service to our Nepalese citizens. The huge advantage is the cost, I would say. The benefit of SSI mantra is the cost and accessibility for us, for Nepalese doctors and Nepalese patients. Since it is made in our neighboring country, India, it is well accessible for us in terms of uh, uh, the, the, the company, in terms of technicians that we had during our early days of installments. So I think uh, it, it is a good advantage for us that uh, our neighboring country is making such a good robot. See, if we uh, go back and if we look uh, look back, then uh, I don't think we'd, we would be uh, able to acquire man uh, robotic system in Nepal if there was no SSI uh, mantra. So definitely it is going to change, not only in developing countries in, like us, I think because the cost is the major uh, hindrance uh, even for developed countries uh, with this cost and with this technology I think uh, Mantra will get a good platform even in developed countries and it, it is going to change I mean see when, when we started uh, other urological surgeries like, like say flexible utroscopy for stone surgery surgeries way back uh, in 2000 13-14 in Nepal, it was considered as very expensive so, uh, I mean, uh, procedure. It was, we used to think that it was not for uh, countries like Nepal and India. Now, uh, similarly, now scopes are being made in India and in China that has cut down the, I mean, total cost of the surgery. Same, same, same with the SSI mantra, you know. Since the total cost of uh, robotic system is significantly low, it is not only going to provide the robotic platform in developing country, but it will change the scenario even in developed country. That, that's what I believe. Medicine or medical field is heavily technology dependent nowadays. It's not like uh, two, three decades back when we used to operate all by our hand, hands, you know. So since we can't deny technology, I think we are more and more technology dependent we don't have choice, we have to go for uh, technology. And what I think is uh, other hospitals, the cost of SSI innovation mantra is as, is. I think it's not even uh, compared to very good CT scan machine. So one can, if one can install very good CT scan or MRI machine, why not SSI mantra, you know? There will be good numbers of hospitals who are interested in uh, acquiring uh, mantra robot in Nepal. See, uh, I do lots of laparoscopic surgery. It's not that lapros laparoscopic surgery is bad or inadequate, uh, but what I felt uh, when I am I'm still trying to move from laparoscopy to robot, I, I just did a couple of cases. What I felt is uh, there are distinct technological or surgical advantage, one. Another is ergonomy, you know. I, I had to stand at bedside for like four or five hours when I do long pelvic surgeries but now i can sit you know uh, comfortably i can take breaks in between i can talk i can you know it's a, it's a big thing for me when we are aging i'm not, i'm still young but when we are aging the, the the comfort also matters you know so apart from technical or surgical advancement uh, there there are other distinct advantages so i think yes uh, i think it's time to change now